Hi friends, so this video shows how to download and install and use MongoDB GUI, MongoDB Compass. So go to this uh, website, MongoDB.com Products Compass, then click on try it now. So then you would get a window like this from here select community edition stable then here you need to select the OS which you are using so I am using Ubuntu so I need to select this option then click on download and save this file I already downloaded this file so let me cancel this so this is a file which I downloaded dot dev file so I need to install it you can right click and open with software install click on this this way you can install it or open terminal and run dpkg minus i command so I am going to use the second option. So here I am going to run dpk hyphen i mongodb combust community. Then enter your soda password. Okay, now it's unpacking mongodb hyphen combust hyphen community. Okay, installation completed. Now let me search for Mongo DB Combos. So you can see Mongo DB Combos icon here. Just click on that. Yes, it's opening. accept this uh, license agreement and we close this uh, window so enable so I'm going to disable all those things okay. now we can enter the host name and port number mongodb server so i am using i actually installed in the local host in the default port number i am using so let me click on connect okay now you can see the dbs in my mongodb server for example let me go to this db media db1 in media db1 you can see one flash and media if you double click on that you can see all the items all the documents in that collection see the list view you can you have option for switch to table view table view and switch view both are there and if you right click on the right click is not working right click on this uh, plus I can to create a new collection and let me select the collection in collection if you want to insert new document your collection you can click on this insert document button then you can just type the key values here Okay, then click on insert. So you can edit on particular field like this. Just double click on the field which you want to edit. Just change the value. You can also delete a particular item. Here you can see the delete option. You can delete the document. Okay. 
then here will test are there to filter the documents aggregations is plain plain and indices you can check all those things so i'm just giving you the introduction you can try all those things or i will create an another video okay i hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel please like and share the video if you have any doubt please comment i will help you So here you can see the total number of dbs 6 dbs and total 10 collections